Portugal has reached a deal on its bailout. The country will get as much as 78 billion euros over the next three years. To comply with the aid package, Portugal will have to slash its budget deficit to 5.9% this year from 9.1% currently. The next goal is 4.5% next year and then 3% in 2013. Acting Prime Minister Jose Socrates said he was pleased with the agreement. The government got a good bailout. It's a deal which defends Portugal. Naturally, there are no bailout programs that are not demanding. This just doesn't exist. We live in times which require efforts and lots of work. Let there be no doubt about this. And our very own Nicole Letano is in Lisbon. We can join her now. Nicole, what's in this package? Well, Mark, the fear here in Portugal had been that the terms of this bailout would be draconian, uh, harsher even than the package that was rejected by opposition parties and sparked this whole crisis. But you heard the Prime Minister there saying uh, that actually this was a good deal for Portugal, and he did win some victories. There's going to be, according to the Prime Minister, no more cuts to public wages and no firing of civil servants. Uh, but there are still some looming questions, foremost among them, what interest rate Portugal is going to pay for this bailout out money. Will the markets then be convinced by this? Well, they're waiting to see whether or not this deal can actually go through. First of all, it needs uh, the blessing, a rubber stamp from the opposition. Because remember, Portugal is going to elections on June 5th. And the government that implements this program is not necessarily the government that's in power right now. The other big question is, can the European Union actually uh, agree to this, given uh, some of the questions raised by the election, uh, or excuse me, by the, the strong showing in the Finnish elections uh, of the true Finn party? This is a Eurosceptic party. Uh, they have said that they don't support the, the Portuguese bailout. And although uh, the government there says they still will be able to, to give their blessing to the Portuguese bailout uh, before a new coalition is formed, uh, there are still a lot of questions in the market.